Hello, my name is Matt Heaston, one of the owners of MTH Lawn Service. My name is Mark LaBarge. I am also the owner of MTH Lawn Service. I am uh, 31 years old from Kalamazoo, Michigan. I am also 31 years old and I am from West Palm Beach, Florida. And what I do for a living is uh, own MTH Lawn Service, one of the co-owners, and uh, kind of over uh, manage our residential route and turf division. I am kind of the guy that holds the glue together. I take care of the concrete, the commercial side of everything, snow removal, lawn care, uh, take care of the excavation and just kind of some of the ground maintenance duties. Matt started mowing lawns uh, for himself in 2007. Two, 2007. Uh, we were still in high school at the time. Uh, we didn't graduate high school until 2008 and then after 2008 uh, Matt was working for another company. So that kind of where his love of lawns developed and 2008 he went out full time, started mowing for himself. I also owned a company called M&L Maintenance at the time as well. And me and Matt have been friends since we were in high school. We rode the same bus together, uh, graduated the same year together, and then I moved to Kalamazoo. I was going to school down, downtown, and so I moved out of the area. Matt stayed in the area, kept his nose down, and kept grinding. Then I, shortly after that, I moved back into Matawan. We started hanging out again, started drinking at the local pub together, hanging out, and then uh, we were doing jobs here and there together when we got big jobs. And then uh, 2015, the winter of 2015, we started together as doing snow removal. And then 2016, we incorporated everything and started branding more around that. Kind of the rest is history. So our target market would be uh, commercial accounts, residential accounts, so uh, condos associations, apartment complexes, uh, warehouse factories. Business fronts. Yep. Uh, and then, you know, obviously uh, residential home. So one thing that makes us unique at MTH Lawn Service would be uh, making sure our staff goes above and beyond and not only meeting but exceeding our customers' expectations. So for example, uh, when they're mowing your house, you know, if you got like landscaping up by your you know, front sidewalk leading to your front door, there may not be no grass there when they mow that kind of gets on the driveway. So when they clean up, we ask them, hey guys, walk up to the front door, just clean any of the dust off, cobwebs, just you know, make it clean and presentable and make the homeowner uh, feel like they're coming home to a nice, well-kept property. We like the saying, you know, make it look like you weren't even here. You know, the, the only thing that we want the customer to see is that the grass was cut, you know? The grass was cut, the landscape beds were maintained as far as weeds pulling and you know, removing sticks after we get like a, a windy storm like we did last night. You know, we got a storm, so you know, we have got, the guys are picking up branches left and right today and that's all we wanted all we wanted in a service is to make it look like we weren't even there. You know, the grass is cut and that's the only thing I want the customer to see. What makes us unique in my opinion is we are the one stop shop. You know, when a customer calls, they ask Marie, hey can you guys do this? And Marie says, Yeah. Most of the time you know you know, I'll have, I'll have Mark call you, or I'll have Matt call you. Just depending on what service you're looking for and who can help the customer with that quote and the next steps uh, to proceed uh, in uh, providing the service to them. One of my favorite memories so far to date of owning uh, MTH Lawn Service would be when I first started out, one of my first few customers come find out is actually a customer of my dad's uh, who he plowed snow for. Uh, when I was a kid riding with him, I ended up actually finding that customer and now today we've been servicing their lawn and snow needs uh, for the last 15 years. So it was kind of cool to reconnect with a customer of my dad's. My favorite part about owning uh, MTH is developing a network. I, I like to network. If anybody knows me, you know they know that I know a lot of people. Um, I, I, I just think that's the best part about being a small business. Like we work with small businesses. We tend not to work with companies that we don't do business with already, like our insurance company, for example. We, we service and, ma and maintenance our insurance office, plus a few of the uh, employees' homes. Um, we service the banks that we do all of our banking and business work at. I would never not want to network. You know, networking is what makes the world go round, in my opinion. I think that's the best part about owning a business is networking and finding ways to connect people with information and information with services, and you know, it just it goes hand in hand. 
One thing that I would say that we are working owners. We, the owner operator definition is us. You know, we come in in the morning with our guys. Matt beats me here every day because I'm doing whatever I'm doing. He gets the doors open, the guys walk in. He gets the guys going and they're servicing our equipment. We change blades every morning, check oils, check air pressure, check the vehicles out, make sure everything's good, trailers are good, and that's all contest to what our team does you know that's that's a team effort you know we have so much equipment that needs to be ready in the morning not one guy can do that yeah everybody has a certain role they partake in and doing stuff Ricky uh, bless his heart out 59 years old goes strong he actually beats me here every day he gets the shop opened up gets all the guys' handheld equipment fuel they need in the truck and we got you know Andrew sharpens the blades and the rest of the staff takes and the you know, they're getting the mowers flipped, as I would call it, getting them ready to go. So they all work together as one to do several tasks, you know, just kind of like a, a football team. Not one guy on that team is going to go win you the Super Bowl. Everybody's got to do their part, do their job, and uh, work together as a team. I call it control chaos here at MTH. You know, nobody has direction, but it seems to always get done in the morning. You know, it just it is what it is. and. Uh, the controlled chaos is definitely needed. Otherwise, you know, the equipment will eventually fail and then that looks bad on us and then when we can't get out there with our equipment. Poorly maintained equipment would, would equally poorly uh, provide a job done. So, well maintained equipment, uh, well looking, completed job. One thing that we take pride in uh, providing our customers would be, you know, we're not just there to collect their money, we're there to go above and beyond their expectations again. Just hearing customers' feedback about how well the guys are doing, it's great, you know, take get that message from the customer related to our guys. And it's just real self-rewarding to hear how well customers' are, uh, expectations are being met. You know, Michigan, we have four seasons. Snow removal is definitely one of the things that is our main staple. That's a 24 hour, seven days a week kind of business. So, you know, you're kind of at the mercy of the weather, but the service needs to be A1 as well. Whether that's at one o'clock in the morning or one o'clock in the afternoon, the service needs to maintain the same. MTH Lawn Service is your one-stop shop for all your property solutions. The seasons may change, but the quality of service at MTH remains the same.